the situation has gone from bad to worse now for folks living at the Warren Manor apartments on Dequinder near eight mile. First, the heat goes out. Well, now water issues in the building, thanks to burst pipes. Sean Lay shows us how the residents are being forced to cope with all of this in the cold. We're inside Warren Manor apartments here in Warren. Tenants telling us no heat for days. Uh, management has given out these little space heaters to try to keep the units warm. And now in this unit, the pipes just burst and today the rent is due. All right, come on in fellas. That is just the start of the crippling problems at Warren Manor Apartments. Oh, my pipes is running from the, the roof right now as we speak, pipes bust open. Everywhere we went, we saw a new issue tenants are being forced to deal with. But I, I brought this in to melt so we could use it. No water at this building, so this man is collecting snow outside to let it melt inside. But that's just to flush the toilet. In another building. They get y'all them little heaters too. No, we ain't got Oh, yeah. Christian Johnson and his wife Danielle shows us that they have no heat and where the pipes just burst. It's freezing already. And in another building, Sheltina Jackson says there are problems with the heat at the worst possible time. How are you heating it? With my stove. And ice is forming on the windows of yet another apartment here. We went with tenants to the office to get answers. Watch any idea when it's going to be back on? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she'll let you know. Okay? We'll call her right now. Thank you. But the president of Rocco Real Estate isn't answering. We went to Rocco's office in Bloomfield Hills. No one there had any answers either. We have alerted the city of Warren about these living conditions in this unbearable cold. They are sending inspectors over as we speak. So no water, no, no heat. water, no water, no, no heat. Water, no heat. And just pay rent today, do yes. it today. Just pay rent today. And again, we're going to continue to try to get answers from Roco Real Estate on when these issues are going to be fixed over in Warren. And again, we've also alerted the city to what's happening there to those tenants. In Bloomfield Hills, Sean Lay, Local 4.